Hello boys and girls. Today, we are going to talk a little bit about prepping. First off, do any of you know what prepping is? Prepping, is having supplies for an emergency. Do your mom and dad have band-aids, just in case you get a cut or scrape? If so, that is prepping. It is a good idea to have some band-aids, on hand, so that they can doctor your cut or scrape, for when an accident happens. Even though the accident has not happened yet, we need the proper supplies, in case something does happen. Prepping, is just stocking up on things and supplies to help us, or keep us safe, in the event of an emergency, or natural disaster. You may see your mom or dad, stocking up on food, or other items. This is nothing to be worried about. Your mom or dad, is simply preparing supplies, so that they can keep you safe, and make sure that you will have plenty of food to eat, in case of an emergency. Many places, often have severe storms. Sometimes these storms may knock out the power. Do you have candles and flashlights at home? Great. Having candles or flashlights, is prepping for a power outage. There is nothing to be scared about when the power goes out, because you are prepared with the right tools for the type of situation. We can never know when a power outage is going to happen. This is why we stock supplies, for when it does. Stocking up on food and water is simply preparing, just in case your mom or dad cannot go to the store to buy more food if there has been a bad storm, and the roads are blocked off. This is nothing to be worried about either. Your mom or dad is just making sure that you will not go hungry, in an emergency. Many of you may be practicing fire drills, in school. This is also prepping. In case of a fire, emergency, you will know what to do. Preparing, can help us, in case something ever happens. It is always a good idea to practice what to do in case of different emergencies. This will help to keep us safe, and we will already know what to do, in different situations. It is fun to help mom or dad, with their prepping. They might need help storing food or water. They might even let you help them test out different things, such as cool, flashlights, or neat, camping gear. It is good, to help mom or dad practice using the items, that they are stocking up on. It can be fun to learn new things with your family. If you have any questions on prepping, then sit down with your mom or dad, and talk to them about it. Who knows, you might can come up with ideas, that your mom or dad, did not think of. And, that is a big help. Now that we have talked about prepping, and why it is good, can you think of any ideas, to help your family be prepared in an emergency? Back in the old days, everyone used to have food pantries. This was a large closet for food storage. Sometimes people would live a day or two away from other people. It was common to have a lot of food stored up for the winter. Some winters were longer than others. It was necessary to have extra food, just in case. This, was also prepping. People have been prepping, for a long time. Your mom or dad may have you an emergency backpack. This is prepping for an emergency, in case you have to leave your home. If we had a lot of rain, there is the possibility that some flooding may occur. It may be necessary to leave your home, to make sure you and your family are safe. Your backpack may have items in it, that will help you, in the type of emergency. Hopefully now, you know what prepping is, and how it can help keep you safe. Talk to your mom or dad if you want to know more about prepping, and what you can do to help them. I am sure that they will have something that you can do, to help them. Always remember, in an emergency, it is good to stay calm. This will help you think of the best way to handle the situation that you are in. Chances are, you may never face an emergency. But, if you do, this is where prepping helps. There is nothing strange about being prepared, so don't be afraid to talk about it with your parents. After all, prepping, keeps us safe. Thank you for watching. Be safe, and God bless.